Respect the Locals is an awareness campaign for shark culling in our local beaches of Australia. It aims to get the community to work together to bring this act of shark culling to a stop through social media, donations and merchandise. I designed an eco-friendly, carbon-reduced, sustainable architectural apartment on a currently underutilised property for individuals wanting to experience Cronulla's pristine beaches with oceanfront living. I have designed a sustainability focused brand that promotes awareness and raises funds for global deforestation through products, a website and social media. The range includes tote bags and a set of jewellery that depicts a theme for a three month period as well as a base collection that will consistently be available. The first quarter's range focuses on Borneo and the effects on orangutans. I have designed a magazine website and app to assist female adolescents to view the positives of their mental health. My Esper brand includes a jewelry line which promotes awareness for specific health disorders through four different crystal meanings, contributing half of my funds to assist the Cambodia community to decline the negative risk towards their mental health. I have designed a lesson plan and activity book to promote and provide fire education to primary school children that haven't received it or a continuation for those who have. I have done this as I believe fire safety is an important requirement in everyone's lives as we are exposed to fire related dangers day to day. designed a sustainable baby wear brand dyed with natural dyes from food waste to raise awareness for the impacts of food waste and the synthetic dye industry on the environment. I have decided to target millennial mums due to their desire for more natural baby products to ensure the safety of their baby. Aussie Icons raises awareness for those Australian animals affected by bushfires. This includes a collection of homeware items that each represent the three most iconic Australian animals. From each purchase made, 30% of the proceeds go to a wildlife organisation of your choice, which have been listed on my website.
I have designed a double level music desk that helps suits the needs of musicians as well as students studying for important work and exams. I chose a music theme because it is scientifically proven that music can help with anxiety and depression since a lot of year 12 students have that. It also creates a calming environment. I have designed a range of soap bars in which I use no single use plastic in the manufacturing process or packaging. I chose to do this as single use plastics are detrimental to the environment, especially the ocean and sea life. Gaia Care helps combat this issue and is chemical free with ethically sourced ingredients. In my project, Ash to Alaya, I've designed and produced a range of handmade timber surf products to encourage and re-promote tourism in fire-affected regions on the New South Wales south coast. My multifaceted design brief required a creative solution to help fund the revival of south coast economies, which was achieved through the social media marketing platform and in the products themselves. My project Virtua is a brand intended to address issues within the fashion industry. Each of the garments represent a different issue through symbolism. The Grace dress is to address sexual assault, the Maryland dress objectification, the Wangari dress environmental depletion, and the Hamilton dress water pollution. They are also all named after inspirational women who have a connection to the issue. It is also a size inclusive range as each garment is made to fit a different size. I've designed a fashion line aimed at young women where all of the scraps from these garments are utilised and turned into clothes to send to African children living in poverty. To promote the need of fast fashion and poverty, I've also created an Instagram to spread awareness and extensively sell my products. I've designed a multi-purpose bag with a garden accessories included for first time indigenous mothers or parents. This design is based off the many ongoing issues with the effects of the stolen generation. The bag includes a place for the newborn to sleep, a swaddle, a blanket, onesie, top and also a portable change station. I have designed and created a dartboard with unique features suitable for homes with entertainment areas such as backyards, game rooms and balconies, improving physical and mental health and hand-eye coordination. I have designed a collection of garments, a tote bag, website and Instagram to raise awareness for animals affected by traditional Chinese medicines. All garments created have a specific focus on an animal affected by traditional Chinese medicines. The purpose of this project was to raise awareness and bring light to this issue unknown in society today.
have designed a dress and social media campaign that raises awareness of the dangers of skin cancer by challenging the misconception that a tan looks healthy. The change in colours and size of the skirt is a visual representation of our skin burning in the sun. Further detail is explained on my TikTok campaign. For my major design project, I've created an animated awareness film that acts to break down stereotypes and misconceptions people have about obsessive compulsive disorder. I utilised various animation and filmmaking techniques in order to achieve this. For the Better is a slow fashion brand that encapsulates customers through an aesthetically pleasing clothing line, photography book and website. This brand aims to educate consumers on the detrimental impact of fast fashion and inform them on how they are contributing to it, thus trying to reduce and diminish the impact of the fast fashion.